Hi, I'm Sheena Douglas and I'm here in the Crafters Companion stand with my brand. The clues are there, Sheena, that'd be me. So um, these are stamps and dies that I draw and I have perfect partners dies that um, fit the size of my stamped images perfectly. And I've been creating these creator flowers right now. These are the latest ones, you make huge flowers. All kinds of different shapes, sizes, just play. And I'm going to show you um, a really nice yeah. little demonstration with this Spectrum Noir Sparkle Pens. So these are pens that are um, they're like a water pen, but they're already come loaded, pre-loaded, with gorgeous colour, intense colour, and sparkle in the form of mica, the best quality mica. And what I'm doing is I'm using the watercolour card here, and I'm just scribbling some paint, some of the paint from the pen, on the card. Then I'm going to take a large brush and I'm going to just drag that across like this. So you can see how I've hardly used any of the product, but with that in the water, because of the intensity of the colour, it's covering all that really nicely. And then I'm just going to keep adding water, drag it down a little bit to create a graduated wash. Just this flat brush, definitely, definitely, if you do this at home, use this larger bit of cord so that you won't have a point where your fingers having to anchor it down because it will bend when you wet it. So continue down till there's almost nothing there. But even the, the bottom here where you think, well, there's hardly any colour and surely that, that mica can't have stretched that far. When it dries, you'll actually see it has. So now we've got a really pretty wash. And at this stage, I would dry it with a heat gun. But I haven't got a heat gun, so we'll just have to carry on. But I am going to wipe the background because I'll get it where I don't want it to be. So if you look at this, can you see the bling on it? It's starting to shine already. And even, I don't know if you can catch at the bottom, can you see? Right, so now, this, I'm gonna show you what I would do, but definitely again, remember, dry this with your heat gun. It'll only take, it'll not even take a minute, it'll take, what, a few seconds to dry it. I'm gonna take a brush again, and water, and I'm gonna draw a circle with the water. If you're not sure about this, if the cord's dry, you can draw around something with a pencil. Um, it'll probably, you'll probably find it easier, but light pre pressure, you don't really want to see the pencil mark. Don't get over um, zealous scrubbing this. The, the t secret here is that you want a lot of water and not a lot of scrubbing of the surface of the cord. And then blot it, and then you've got a really nice moon there in the sky. And then if you want to put some nice wispy um, kind of atmospheric clouds, a brush again, little circles, and just keep going and then maybe make them a little bit thinner. These are going to be wispy clouds, so I'm dragging them out a little bit. Now what this is doing, this is releasing that paint, and then I'm going to say, I'm going to use that paint, thank you, so it's going to be a negative, but then I'm going to drag it across the moon, so now it becomes positive, and then I can block that. And then you've got those wispy clouds coming across the moon. And I'll do a little one here. And then you've got that look in there. And then to finish it, in fact, I'm just going to lighten that a little bit more. And I like the fact that you've got some lighter and darker because it makes it look more natural with the clouds. Back to that large brush. And now I'm going to contour the land. So I'm going to stop put in some hills and things here so just drag this paint and you'll see it'll start to move the paint and start making little kind of um, like hills and things as if it's snowy landscape and then if you want to even lighten this further maybe you want to highlight down here just wet that and then we can take our paper again and just drag a little bit And then I think I'm going to leave it at that. And there you have it. And that's not quite dry, so it's not sparkled properly yet. 